Today we're going to talk about Mobile Suit Gundam of Witch from Mercury, Episode 1. So, keep on watching. I have uh, high hopes for this one because, well, Gundam po eh, right? Arguably the most established anime franchise right now. So, first things first, let's explain the thumbnail. It's quite a final scene, kasi before the, the two main protags got to an agreement of sorts, well, um, Suleta, one of them, one of the main, one of the two main protags, handily defeated uh, the former holder, see si Duel. Wow, right? She really shut this, uh, shut this, uh, this arrogant swine's mouth. Everybody then realized now that the mobile suit Soleto was actually using is a Gundam. So the higher ups of their uh, management committee, mga yun mga dulo sila. Oh, they're not surprised anymore. This girl is a Gundam pilot. Trust me, guys. This particular thumbnail, yeah, you can you, you can put it on your laptops as a as desktop wallpaper because it, yeah, it, it looks really good. Now, down to business. Face. I'm going to I'm going to prepare myself from now on that every time there's a battle scene in this content series, the pacing will pick up, and it has picked up twice already. Now, there was a previous uh, battle scene here, and wow, that was um, that was tense. Then, well. You could say that it prepared me for um for this particular fantasy which led to uh which led to the thumbnail. Yep, it did mentally prepare me. <laughs> this guy Duel got shown the door by uh someone he thought as a um a country bumpkin, a country girl, yung dan yung wala yung mang mang, yeah. Okay. This guy's a dickhead. And he Really got shown the door. Oi! The girl you just challenged is a fucking Gundam pilot! So, well, you got your ass whipped. <laughs> the pacing will make you realize this and will make you feel these emotions. These emotions I'm uh, I'm uh, I'm showing to you right now, guys. So, um I was entertained by the mere pacing of this episode. Talagang, Masasabi mo na Gundam series yang ito. So, yep. My standards will be very high already when it comes to reviewing this one. Trust me, guys. Flow na lang. First gear shift here was was when Duel uh, started trashing Mirin's greenhouse. Mirin is the other main product. It's clearly a show of arrogance on the part of the um, on, on part of this um, uh, yeah, this dickhead. He just, uh, he just proved to me right there and then that, yeah, he's a dickhead. Okay, he's an aristocratic dickhead. <laughs> That's basically uh, what kind of character this is. Flat out, second gear shift. This may not be a gear shift to you, but for me, guys, oh, this is the first time I'm, uh, I'm reviewing a Gundam series. So, for me, this is a gear shift. When Soleta was able to take back her Gundam, kasi pinirate ni Miurin para lang makaganti kay Duel. But why do I call this a gear shift? Well, you can say that this gear shift practically um, showed both main products, Miurin and uh, Soleta, that well, they can coexist. Okay, they can coexist and they may become friends. Because when when it comes to uh, when it comes to this guy, you will. Well, I think they both agree that he's a dickhead. Okay? How many times have I used that word already? <laughs> it, it's a it's a perfect description of his character. Final gear shift was when well after after kicking. Duel in the balls, alright, figuratively, 
Murin awards Soleta the the holder suit. Well, based on what did I call as a gear shift. Oh, it just goes. It just showed me that Murin has finally, in so short a time, huh? Finally accepted uh, Soleta as an equal. Now, nah, well, you could say that she was quite impressed of how uh, of how Soleta fought this dickhead. Yeah, with this ass, okay? Soleta with this ass here. This girl should also tell you that mm, an alliance has been formed. Looks like this Gundam series will be anchored on the relationship of these two main protagonists, Soleta and Miri. Okay, so ah, uh, well, right now, guys, I'm telling you, I'm looking forward to uh, to reviewing further episodes from this Gundam series. Plot wise, Wala, unremarkable. Kunde, malinis. It's not, well, it's not Yu-Gi-Oh! Wherein, uh, an entire episode is dependent on a, uh, on a fight, battle, or, or a duel scene. But, hey, this is Gundam, right? When it comes to, when it comes to storylines, they're, they're always in the conversation. Okay? This anime franchise is always in the conversation. And this series proves it. Every Gundam series is known for its clean plots. Nearly, nearly every series, nearly every Gundam series actually. And again, this Gundam series is no different. So, I didn't find any kinks or any sudden breaks in the in the episode storyline. No, this was, you can say it was an actual chain of events leading to the final scene. Which shows us how the dynamic between Soleta and Miurin uh, started. Oh, they, they had a common God. They yeah, they both think that Gul is a dickhead. Okay. Again, how many times have I used that word? <laughs> Comment below. You really need a clean plot to tell the audience that this that the two main contacts didn't start off on the right foot, but Ended the episode on a high note. You can't do it with a well ironed out plot. Kuha ka na ng backstory or future sequence. Well, that's it for that. No! You have to make the viewer understand that this will be the dynamic between Suleta and Mio Green from here on in. Now, that's, at least that's, that's what this episode's storyline is telling me. The episode's clean plot is telling me. Yeah, for me. This one has a clean plot, guys. So, pace, flow, and plot. <sighs> Tell you the truth, I, I almost did, wasn't able to um to discern the pacing from the plot because the plot was that clean. The plot was that clean. I wasn't. I was almost totally unconscious of the pacing of this episode. Say, malinis, okay? malinis talaga yung plot. And well, we can see now that Sunrise has another, um, well, technically a good follow up to Iron Blooded Orphans. We got one here. So, Mobile Suit Gundam, The Witch from Mercury, Episode 1. This one is. My party shot for, um, at least for this episode, is this. Sign of things to come. Overall, you know nothing sa akin ng episode nato, guys. So, like I said just a while ago, I'm gonna enjoy reviewing this one. So again, Mobile Suit Gundam: The Witch from Mercury, Episode One. Two thousand.